ready to fight? Ready. Let's do it. All right, here we go. It's round one between Max Holloway and Yaya Rodriguez. Matchmaking at its finest. A lot of people thought we would have seen this fight earlier. It shall be done tonight. Your thoughts on how it might play? This is a phenomenal fight between two very young but ultra-talented competitors. Yair Rodriguez has been a star from the moment he jumped into the octagon, and Max Holloway has won more consistently than anyone we've ever seen in the UFC Family Division. Man, back and forth we go, and early on, these guys getting after They told us it would be fun, and so far, they've delivered. There's that jab from Max Holloway. Didn't take him long to find a hole for that tonight. I mean, Max Holloway constantly fights behind the jab, and you would expect it at the start of every single fight. The jab leads to everything else that he does inside the outfit. Frantic pace early on to this one. And he's looking for that left hand, just missed. Now he's got the single collar and the clinch. Hard shots landing on both sides here. And there is that kicking game from Yair Rodriguez on full display early on in this one tonight. Yeah, Yair Rodriguez is a beast. And you know when you watch him, when you're going into the octagon, you got to always be on high alert because he can hit you from anywhere. And a lot of times, it comes from those kicks, those very diverse, scary, dangerous, challenging to understand kicks that he throws. Well, you see why Holloway was such a fan favorite. Beautiful land there with the left hand, and now we'll see what he can do. Just over three minutes to go round one. Right lands. Well, it looks as though that strike maybe opened up a cut around the eye area. Yeah, it looks like that strike opened up a cut, John, but it's nothing to worry about now, but he's got to start to protect it. Almost in range with the straight left, but that's a miss. So 33 total strikes have landed for Max Blessed Holloway. Look at him with his hip into that kick. Champ, I don't see that well, but it's hard to miss the redness underneath that elbow. A lot of bodily investment from his opponent tonight. Yeah, it's an investment, John. It may not pay dividends right now, but the more you go there, the more damage you do eventually, it will show itself. Right now, it's starting to show. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively, protecting his head, raising the guard, and really frustrating the offensive fighter a little bit. Lesson one in boxing class. Hands up, chin down. Not there. Under two minutes to go here in round one. Just misses with that one. So it's never just one shot. There's always two or three coming behind. A lot of times people throw singular strikes. Not this gentleman. This man is stringing four or five, six in a row. What a great job. You never know where it's coming from. You don't know if he's going to do a cartwheel, try to kick you. You never know what's happening from Yaya Rodriguez. Late round action here. It has been a masterful striking display as we have come to expect from Max Holloway. Moving his head beautifully defensively and when he throws, doesn't miss a whole lot. I mean, it's just the accuracy at which that he throws, John. This guy doesn't waste anything. Everything he throws, he throws with the intention of getting to the target. He is as accurate as they come. And tonight, we are seeing the best Max Holloway. Oh, quick right hand. 30 seconds now to go in round one. Well, now that cut in the eye area, Daniel, becoming a major storyline. He's got to be careful. He's got to be very careful and address it right now before it gets to the point that there's nothing you can do about it. Ten seconds to go in the round.
into that clinch this way. All right, DC, let's look at some of the highlights from the last round. Lots for the replay guys to choose from. Yeah, man, these guys stood on a quarter in the middle of the octagon. Take one to give one. Over and over, each guy landed, and they both landed very well over the course of that first round. All right, here we go with our second round. It is Max Holloway versus Yair Rodriguez. All right, DC is back from the concession stand. As we get our next round underway, and you had to like what you saw in terms of the volume and the efficiency on the feet in that previous round. Oh, he did a great job of just being active, really setting down on those right hands, showing that it was not only going to be striking, but a lot of significant strikes landed over the course of that round. So Rodriguez continuing to manage distance beautifully tonight. He's got his kicking game up. He's so long. So Yair uses those kicks to not only brutalize you, but to maintain space. He's a well-rounded mixed martial artist. He's really improved in the wrestling, but ultimately, the kicking game will always be what defines Yair. He's looking for that left hand. Not there. Both fighters starting to open up a little bit. Rodriguez, his eye is starting to swell shut. Holloway's uppercut is blocked. Looked like for a minute he had a window there. It closed quickly. He ripped the body there. Well, you got to think he's going to enjoy watching this one back tomorrow morning. He has landed a ton of significant strikes. And Really, a guy who has been a monster in the gym finally putting it together here in the office. To go home and admire your work, it doesn't take till the next morning. He's going back to office right now and firing up the video to look at beauty in action. And he was the one causing all the action. Lands a big elbow there. Rodriguez is able. All right, so the referee has called a halt to the action here, likely to have the doctor come in and look at the swelling around that eye. Not good, DC. You cannot allow these fighters to dictate and determine whether or not they can go. When you have this type of swelling, you got to take a close look to see if the guy can compete. Dr. Corral's the referee. It looks as though this fight will continue, at least for now. But certainly that swelling bears watching as we move forward. You ready to fight? You ready? All right, well, this fighter was bullish in his desire to continue, and the doctor is going to afford him that opportunity as the referee gets us back underway. This guy's a fighter, man. This guy doesn't want to lose a fight on the stool. He wants an opportunity to go out there and go out on the shield. And that's exactly what he's getting. He's getting a chance, and as a fighter, that's all you can ask for. And you know fans don't like doctor stoppages, so they are thrilled. They start booing. And sometimes guys' eye is hanging off the side uh -huh. of his head. Well, it's a bloody Saturday, folks. He's really starting to leak out of that eye area, Danny. Well, he's leaking, John. He's wide open. The eyes are beat up. The guy is taking a beating, and the blood has to be affecting his vision at this point. He checked that last one. Well, he was a little bit lackluster in round one. You can't say the same here in this second round. He has really picked up the pace, an uptick in the aggression and the output, and starting to find his range here in the pocket. Well, he just missed on another strike there. He has not been efficient with his attack here tonight. And offensively, I think his approach leaving a lot to be desired. Got to figure out a way to conserve some energy here moving forward. Just over. Oh! Oh, he's stuck bad. He's got to grab him. He's got to recover. Oh, big elbow. Oh, look at that leg kick. Rodriguez is really bleeding heavily now. That cut is only getting worse by the minute. Low kick lands flush. Yeah, he's got to. He's got to start checking kicks. Pretty good stuff getting that kick home. And now Leather being thrown on both sides. Rodriguez hook shot there looked pretty good, but blocked by the defense. Under a minute now to go in this one. 
All right, so perhaps he's going to have to address something defensively. There is a legitimate... All right, so at this point, maybe the ringside position will indeed call the fight. Referee bringing him in to look at that damage. Got to save the athlete from themselves. Too much damage. Stop the fight, ref. <laughs> he's looking. Yeah, this is... Yeah, yeah, you yep, that's the end of the fight. Yeah, you do. You knew it was done right away. So the ringside position has no choice but to stop the fight. The fans don't like it, but that fighter will live to fight. Okay, brand new day, I'm brilliant. I feel hair like William. Don't play, got skill like Brazilian. One day I'm gonna make more than a million. Thinking paper, AM to PM, come like Christina Millian. Think twice if you wanna get silly and dumb, I'll send man a box at million. Don't play.